Last month, a customer in Pimlico called us out um, and they had a rat problem. We yeah. obviously went out and we've uh, managed to put in a vermin into the drain system to yeah. stop the rats coming back in. Yeah. Um, just last week, the ladies called us back. Can you just tell me why she's called us back after we put a vermin in? It should be working. Why did she call us back? She called us back for an unblock. She said that waste was getting caught up behind the blocker and that the blocker was, in fact, put in the wrong way. When, in reality, another contract company went out to remove the blocker and clear the waste. So another drainage company. Another went. drainage company, not us, went back to clear the, clear the blockage for her and, incidentally, damaged the blocker by removing it and then putting it back afterwards so that once the lady was flushing afterwards that as you can see there the flow is on this side drainage is meant to run out like that where the flap was running the wrong way it gives the impression that it's running the wrong way towards the blocker and when this, is the, this is the actual this, this is the actual, the actual blocker that out. we've that we've removed i mean as you can see this is a good one new one that we install on a daily basis flaps are all straight and so that's I think how. it's worth noting that if you have a vermin put in by us or another contractor, the most important thing is that you call the same contractor to put the vermin in to come and unblock it and to, to make sure that it works um, thoroughly. If you don't, then what happens is someone will come, they'll put a drain rod or a jetter into the flap, not realise there's a flap, and as they try to withdraw it, it will get caught on the, the serrated edge and then it will damage the actual vermin. And these are not cheap to replace, so um, it's always best if you have a vermin put in, make sure you call the contractor to come out and fix that for you.